That is right. Good morning. Make some more noise for the Ukiah High School Class of 2023. Good morning on all of, or for all of us here at Ukiah High School and on behalf of the staff, the coaches, we welcome you to this wonderful, wonderful event on a beautiful day in this beautiful valley of Mendocino County. Please stand as we welcome seniors Lexi Urbina and Brandon Beltran Reyes to lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Yo prometo lealtad a la bandera de los Estados Unidos de América y a la república que representa Nación bajo Dios entera con libertad y justicia para todos. Please remain standing as the Ukiah High School Vocal Ensemble presents our nation's national anthem. Thank you. Please remain standing for one more presentation. Ukiah High School is a home that celebrates the passion of students and has compassion for one another and celebrates the diversity. The diversity that this school has is the strength that it possesses. Please welcome members of our Northern Pomo language class, seniors that will be presenting the Northern FOMO blessing for this ceremony. Amito Ani Kekanema, Le Kekanema Kirida, Nanya Weno, Yakiabri Yawi. Yahweh, <laughs> 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 
That was beautiful. Thank you, Northern Pomo language class here at Ukiah High School. And before we begin our graduation ceremony, please welcome Dionysi Macias, who will lead us in a moment of silence for one of our classmates that passed away. Dionysi Macias. On August 24, 2019, the first week of our freshman year, I received a text that my best friend, Jimena Sanchez, had passed away after a courageous battle with cancer. Jimena was a member of this class, the Ukiah High School of 2023. Jimena was a bright soul. On a bad day, her joy and laugh was so contagious that you'd forget your pain. Every each day, she lived with love. When she got sick with cancer, I was sad and devastated. I visited her on the weekends at the Oakland Children's Hospital. While pain medication and treatment limited her ability to speak, she was there as I sat with her, holding her hand and she would nod. I told her how much I loved her and she responded with me too. Those two words were the last she ever spoke to me. Jimena, my bright soul, I love you. You are here today in our hearts. Please join me in a moment of silence to honor our friend and classmate, Jimena Sanchez.
Okay. Yes, thank you. Please be seated. Joining me on stage today are people that are instrumental in bringing all of the programs and making the joy of Ukiah High School truly joyful. Superintendent Deborah Kuban, one of our assistant principals, Yareli Macias, school board members and parents, Ms. Fernandez and Ms. Van Zandt. And now, please welcome student body president, Isabel Van Zandt, and senior class president, Yahaira Corlon Naldano, to welcome you to this ceremony. Good morning. I am Isabel Van Sant, the Associated Student Body President. And I am Yahaira Carlo Maldonado, Senior Class President. Bienvenidos. Mi nombre es Isabel Van Sant, y soy la Presidente del Cuerpo Estudiantil Asociado. Y mi nombre es Yahaira Carlo Maldonado, la Presidenta del Cuarto Año. We want to offer you a heartfelt welcome to Ukiah High School's Class of 2023 graduation. As much as this is a celebration to honor the accomplishments of each of the 360 members of our class, this is also a celebration to honor each member of the audience sitting here today for helping us reach this moment. We could not have made it without the endless support of each of you. We would like to recognize the meaningful contributions you have made to each member of our class. Over the past few weeks, graduating seniors have expressed in writing the many things we appreciate about our fa family, friends, and teachers. We would like to share some of what our classmates have written. These words reflect the feelings of all of us. Queremos ofrecerle un cordial bienvenida a la graduación del clase de 2023 de Ukiah High School. Mientras esta es una celebración para honrar los logros de cada uno de los 360 miembros de nuestra clase. Esta ceremonia también es una celebración de cada miembro de la audiencia por ayudarnos a alcanzar este momento. No podríamos haberlo logrado sin el apoyo incondicional de todos ustedes. Nos gustaría reconocer las contribuciones significativas que han hecho a cada miembro de nuestra clase. En las últimas semanas, los estudiantes del cuarto año han expresado por escrito muchas cosas que apreciamos de nuestra familia, amigos y maestros. Queremos compartir parte de lo que nuestros compañeros han dicho. Sus palabras reflejan los pensamientos de todos nosotros. You've given us good advice. Nos han dado buenos consejos. As our classmate said, Mom, you have been my role model for all 12 years of school. You have taught me how to be a caring, strong, and loving person. You have given me hope where I thought hope was all lost. You have shown me how to be a good man and what not to do when going on that first date. You have shined your light when my light couldn't. Como dijo nuestro compañero, ha sido mi modelo durante los 12 años de escuela. Me has enseñado a ser una persona solidaria, fuerte, y amorosa. Me has dado esperanza donde pensaba que se había perdido toda esperanza. Me has enseñado cómo ser un buen hombre y qué no hacer en esa primera cita. Has hecho brillar tu luz cuando mi luz no podía. You have sacrificed for us, and your sacrifice has inspired us to be better people. Te has sacrificado por nosotros, y tu sacrificio nos ha inspirado a ser mejores personas. From our classmate Luis Fonseca, dear parents, it's been a long road, and I wouldn't trade your support in time for the world. I know I'm not the best student, but I have a pure heart because of you. I owe it all to you because you came to the States with nothing and gave me everything. To my father for being the hardest working person I have ever met, for always having a smile on his face, and even though the world turns its back on him, he does not turn his back on the world. And to you, mother, for always being the brilliant person that you are, and for always taking care of me and comforting me when I needed someone the most. Luis Fonseca escribió, Queridos padres, ha sido un largo camino y no cambiaría su apoyo y tiempo por nada del mundo. 
Sé que no soy el mejor estudiante, pero tengo un corazón puro gracias a ustedes. Todo se lo debo a ustedes porque llegaron a los Estados Unidos sin nada y me dieron todo. A mi padre por ser la persona más trabajadora que he conocido, por tener siempre una sonrisa en su rostro y aunque el mundo le dé la espalda, él no le da la espalda al mundo. A ti, madre, por ser siempre la persona brillante que eres y por cuidarme siempre y consolarme cuando más necesito a alguien. You gave us new opportunities. Nos han dado nuevas oportunidades. As Lizette Chavez said, I could overcome all the terrible moments because you were there to support me and teach me the good things in life. Thanks to you, I received a good education, something that you couldn't have, not because you didn't want to, but because you couldn't. It was a, op a new opportunity that you gave me, and with that I say that I did it for you, so that you would be proud of your last daughter who will continue to make you proud. Como ha dicho Lizette Chavez, puedo sobrepasar todos los momentos terribles porque ustedes estuvieron allí para apoyarme y enseñarme lo bueno de la vida. Gracias a ustedes, recibí una buena educación, algo que ustedes no pudieron tener, no porque no querían, sino porque no podían. Pero fue una oportunidad nueva que me dieron a mí para cumplir. Y con eso digo que lo hice por ustedes, para que estuvieran orgullosos de su última hija, quien continuará a hacerles orgullosos. And finally, you've shown us unconditional love and support. Finalmente, nos han mostrado amor y apoyo incondicional. As Kai Tucker said, your support and guidance have been a constant source of strength for me throughout the years. Our heart-to-heart -heart talks have provided a safe space where I could freely express my thoughts and emotions, knowing that you would listen with understanding. Your presence during rough times has been a true lifeline, as you've shown an incredible ability to lift me up and help me find my way through even the darkest of days. Kai Tucker escribió, su apoyo y guía han sido mi fuerza durante estos años. Nuestras conversaciones de corazón a corazón han creado un espacio seguro donde puedo expresar libremente mis pensamientos y emociones, sabiendo que nunca me juzgarás. Su pres presencia durante estos momentos difíciles ha sido un verdadero salvavidas, ya que, has ya que me has ayudado a encontrar mi camino incluso en los días más oscuros. In closing, we know that one of our classmates speaks for all of us when she wrote to her parents, I hope you're as proud of yourself during this graduation as you are of me. Thank you. Para terminar, sabemos que una de nuestras compañeras de clase habla por todos nosotros cuando les escribió a sus padres. Espero que estén tan orgullosos de ustedes mismos durante esta graduación como lo están de mí. Gracias. Thank you in gratitude. We did not practice this part, but the Ukiah High School class of 2023, give your parents and the ones that have loved you a standing ovation. Please stand and applaud. They loved you this far. Parents, family, neighbors, community, we love you. Thank you very much. A proud tradition at Ukiah High School graduations is to honor Distinguished graduates, please welcome senior Haley Newman, who will present Bob Giannini in honoring of this year's distinguished graduate. While she's looking for the information, I just want to say hello to the class of 2023. Really an honor to be here. Good morning, Ukiah High School and families. My name is Haley Newman, and I would like to welcome Bob Giannoni to the stage. Mr. Giannoni will be receiving the Distinguished Graduate Honor on behalf of his late wife, Dr. Peggy Peterson Giannoni. Dr. Peggy Peter Peterson Giannoni, this year's Distinguished Graduate, 
graduated from Ukiah High School in 1968, where she was very involved in student government act and activities. After earning her Master's of Science in Biology, she spent 25 years as a research director in epidemiology. In 2004, she earned her PhD in epidemiology. Peggy's dissertation reported her research findings on how government programs can better help deve developmentally disabled children. Please give a round of applause for the Giannonis. Very nicely done, thank you. I'd like to thank uh, Ukiah High School for hosting the uh, distinguished graduate today. I'd like to thank uh, the Alumni Association. And Buck Ganner, would you stand up behind me here? And Buck Ganner championed Peggy's nomination through the Alumni Association. I'd like to say I've got about two hours of things to talk. First, Bucky told me I would have six minutes. About a week ago, he said five. And last night at dinner, he told me I had two minutes. So here we go. Um, I wish you could see the plaque. Peggy was this stunningly beautiful woman. Um, I know your, your first priority is to come back to the high school and go through the library. But that's where this plaque will be. And you could see a picture of this stunningly beautiful woman that was so very intelligent. And guess what? In her senior year book, she was voted best dressed. So you got stunningly beautiful, best dressed, and intelligent. That's why she is so very distinguished. So just real quickly, um, if Peggy were here today, she She'd tell you all to follow your hearts, really to follow your heart. Peggy was a junior in college and wanted to be a sociologist, and she took a science class. And she fell in love with the sciences, and from then on, her passion was to learn how to help mothers and their infant children. And her full career was dedicated to how to increase their health. Um, how many of you graduates know someone who managed a wilderness float plane fly fishing camp in Alaska's Katmai National Park and had to chase grizzly bears out of the camp all summer? I think that distinguishes her. Yeah, yeah. In, in addition to all of her career work as an epidemiologist, she also managed fly fishing schools. How many people do you know from Ukiah that managed fly fishing schools for five summers up outside Yellowstone National Park? Okay, leaving the best, I think, for last. Um, Peggy was a wonderful mother, wife, and friend to everyone. And we were enraptured with her the entire time we had the honor of spending with her. And so I'm just going to real quickly ask her two daughters if they would stand up, Alexa and Kristen, and then grandson Addie. Thank you so much for the honor. Please welcome our first student speaker this morning, Mr. Noah Edelman. Ms. McCombs, Ukiah High School Band Director and one of my favorite teachers, once remarked that the reason she loves Ukiah High School is that it is practically a city unto itself. Within our campus, within our student body, 
There are musicians and mechanics, writers and woodworkers, painters and poets, photographers and floral designers. With our varied skills, I would have to agree with Ms. McCombs that we are truly a complete cross-section of society. Our education thus far has prepared this cross-section of society to enter the world and improve it. Through the school values of integrity, compassion, productivity, and creativity, we have learned the basic essentials of citizenship. Let me be blunt. Our cohort, one quarter of Ukiah High City, the senior class of 2023, is entering a troubled world. The world is plagued by prejudice, inequality, and injustice. America is plagued by gun violence, homophobia, sexism, racism, police brutality, and division. California is plagued by drought and wildfires, the increasingly dire impacts of climate change. And yet, here, in Ukiah, my 359 classmates inspire hope in me. Our community is innovating, improving, problem solving. Our environmental club is addressing our climate problems with creek cleanups and rain gardens. Our mock trial team is tackling our legal system, practicing tools to address injustice. Our band brings us hope and strength through music. I could go on, but my point is this. Every member of our Ukiah High School community has learned what we need to face the world's problems. And I believe that every one of us has the power to apply that understanding to the complex problems that we face. None of us can single-handedly fix the world. What gives me hope that we will improve it nonetheless is our sheer diversity. Our diversity of talents, viewpoints, and beliefs. Combined, the total knowledge of our entire senior class is amazingly comprehensive. For that reason, I ask of you all one favor. Vote. Vote in every election you encounter to consolidate our shared learning into a consensus. Ukiah High School is a cross-section of the world still learning what our generation's legacy will be. We are ready to continue making our mark on the world, whether through attending trade school or college, joining the military, finding a job, or studying abroad. We have learned to be citizens and students of the world, but our cohort is still in the process of discovering the new unknown skills and innovations that we will need in order to confront the incredible challenges our generation faces. My imperative to you is to vote. We have had four years to learn the essential basis of our society and world. Now, it is not a luxury, but a necessity to apply those skills to our diverse and exciting futures. Thank you, Noah. And now it is time to get this party started with some music. And coming up, we have Valle Exclusivo Proforni. That's right, give it up, Valle, Valle Exclusivo. And they performed for us here at Ukiah High School many times, and we bring them to you today. And today's selection, Mexicano Americano. Check, 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 check. Check, check, check. Bueno, así como no somos sus compas del Grupo Valle Exclusivo. Vamos a cantar esa canción que se llama México Americano. We're a band from Ukiah. Our name is Vice Exclusive. We're gonna sing this song that is named the Mexican American. And let's go class of 2023. Y puro Valle Exclusivo, ya saben.
Por mi madre yo soy mexicano Por el destino soy americano Yo soy de la raza de oro Yo soy México americano Yo te Of 2023. Our diversity is indeed our strength. Thank you, gentlemen. And now for our next student speaker, please welcome Ms. Alondra Campuzano Archundia. Hola, yo me llamo Alondra Campuzano. Querida clase del 2023, ha llegado el día que todos hemos esperado, el día que por cuatro años los hemos estado preparando. Primero, les quiero dar las gracias a todos por acompañarnos en este día tan especial para todos nosotros. Hoy es un día muy feliz, pero también es el día que nos despedimos de nuestros compañeros de escuela. Y sobre todo, es un día muy especial para los padres que sus hijos se van a graduar en primera generación y están cumpliendo los sueños que sus padres no pudieron cumplir por emigrar a este gran país donde las oportunidades están para quien las quiera aprovechar. Y quiero agradecer el sacrificio de cada uno de los padres que dejaron atrás a sus familias por venir a darnos una mejor vida. Me siento muy orgullosa de ser hija de padres inmigrantes y tener el privilegio de graduarme y poder continuar mis estudios universitarios. El apoyo de mi familia ha sido fundamental para mí y por eso les doy las gracias. Por eso me siento muy feliz y espero que mis compañeros se sientan igual por haber podido llegar a este, mom a este momento tan importante en nuestras vidas. Este logro se los dedico a mis padres que llegaron sin nada, pero me lo dieron todo. Gracias. Another proud tradition at Ukiah High School 
is our seniors honoring teachers that they recognize for their outstanding service. Please welcome seniors Callie Garcia, Brandon Belton Reyes, Joey Reynolds Boatwright, and Diego Fernandez, and the teachers that they will be introducing. Our first presenter is senior Callie Garcia, presenting English teacher Kate McCarthy. Good morning. My name is Callie Garcia and today I will be speaking about Ms. McCarthy, one of our Distinguished Educators of the Year. I would first like to take this opportunity to thank her on behalf of the entire senior class for being an outstanding class advisor. You have guided us through our last year in high school and have made it a memorable experience just being in your presence. Ms. McCarthy is one of the kindest and most understanding people anyone could meet. Her unconditional love for teaching and for her students is a big reason why the senior class loves her so much. She cares deeply about our accomplishments and successes, not only in school, but also in life. She goes above and beyond for each and every one of us. She will drop anything she was doing just to hear us out, give us advice, or help us on our assignments, just to be a shoulder to cry on. She will give you advice on life, school, or even on your relationship, and not sugarcoat anything. <laughs> she can be brutally honest sometimes, but it is a huge reason why we admire her so much. She is very passionate when it comes to her students. To us, we all consider her to be our mama bear, and some of us quite literally call her that. She has been our protector all year long and stood up for us like no one ever has before. Mrs. McCarthy was one of, <clears throat> for most of us, was only our freshman English teacher. We were sadly blessed only once with her incredible presence as our teacher, but despite all that, she still continued to be there for us. She is now one of the librarians, and that is where most of us go for help, advice, or just to bug her. <laughs> Anyone that has had her as a teacher knows how entertaining she makes each class. She would always try and enlighten the mood by joking around with us, and still does three years later. Mrs. McCarthy, you truly are a beautiful person inside and out. You have made our senior year one to never forget, and I can't possibly think of another teacher that is as deserving as this award as you are. Congratulations, Ms. McCarthy. We'll miss you tremendously, but we will never forget all that you have done. The senior class truly loves you. Now please welcome Brandon Beltran Reyes presenting Liz Johnson Ward. Hello everybody, my name is Brandon Beltran Ruelas and today I'm very grateful to have the opportunity to be here to talk about everybody about Distinguished Educator Liz Johnson Ward. I had had the pleasure to have her my sophomore year and again my senior year. And one thing I can say about Miss J is that she has one of the kindest souls you'll ever meet. And as you step into your classroom, you immediately feel welcomed. I'm positive anyone who has had her can also agree. She is a teacher who not only helps guide you through your academics, but your personal problems as well. She never stops to encourage you to choose what's best for you and what makes you happy. She's made learning extremely fun with her out-of-the-box assignments and energetic personality, and we can't forget her unforgettable dances or singing in class. 
Although she's taught history, the next following year, she will be leading the leadership class as well, where she will make her own history, leading them with her spirit. She, got, she did get married and change her last name to Ward, but she will always be Ms. Johnson to us. Go, Ms. Johnson! And now, please welcome Joey Reynolds Boatwright presenting Spanish teacher Ollie Praxlodge. Good morning. My name is Joey Reynolds Boatwright, and it is an honor to be presenting Ollie Praxlodge as one of the class of 2023's distinguished educators. I've had the pleasure of having Senora Prox Lodge for all four years of my high school experience and serving as her TA for the last two. I can easily say that her class was my favorite and I know many others share my sentiments. One of her most outstanding qualities is her ability to make the material she teaches come alive. Through her interactive lectures, projects, and discussions, the material became so much more than words in a textbook. Senora Prox Lodge is an amazing educator, and her passion for the Spanish language, as well as the care she has for her students, is evident in everything she does. She provides a safe and welcoming space for all who enter her classroom, and is always willing to lend a listening ear. In her class, we have learned so much more than Spanish. Public speaking, compassion, and the importance of constructive criticism and the pursuit of knowledge. All of these are invaluable qualities and skills which I know will serve us well as we move out into the real world. Senora Prox Lodge is a huge source of inspiration for so many and truly deserves this award. I would do high school all over again if it meant I got to take her classes again. Thank you. And now please welcome Diego Fernandez presenting American Institutions and AP Comparative Government teacher, Mr. Jeffrey Silva Brown. As a senior walking into class every day and knowing that you're gonna be fully engaged is a, is a special feeling. And this feat was accomplished by a teacher whose wit and charisma and meticulous preparation kept our rapt attention all year. Not only did we laugh in his class, but we truly did learn. We learned to think critically about decisions made by our governing leaders, as well as those we make for ourselves. Mr. Silva Brown, on behalf of the senior class, I want to thank you. Thank you for your dedication to excellence, holding not only yourself to the highest standards, but us as well, whether we liked it or not. Thank you for spending hours preparing the Mastery Check videos because you knew that you could outteach the college board. And surprise, surprise, you were right. Thank you for giving us a window into how our country and world operate, and even more importantly, how we can affect positive change in both. Thank you for blessing us with your love of learning, good humor, and those beautiful blue Dodger blue shirts you'd wear every day. <laughs> I want you to know that you've instilled in those fortunate enough to be your students the capacity to understand the complex dynamics of the world and in turn, do something to make this a better place for everyone. Mr. Silva Brown, you are the definition and embodiment of a true educator. Thank you for everything you do. Thank you. Thank you. 
Another round of applause for these instructors and all of their teammates that have educated the Ukiah High School class of 2023. And now please welcome our next performer, senior Sinead Bermudez, performing the song, Unwritten.
One more time, give it up, Sinead. And now, please welcome our final student speaker today, Ms. Kayla Tolman. Good morning, everyone. I'm happy to see you all out here today, especially my fellow graduates. After 13 years of being together in school, it's finally time to say goodbye to each other. Now we must surrender our childhood to our future. As kids, we grew up with the number 2023 engraved in our minds, a reminder of our adolescence counting us down to adulthood. That's so far away, we'd say, or I can't wait. Until now, we are reminiscing days of our innocence and happiness, but the one thing that we have failed to notice is that to our parents, their baby is finally all grown up. them, this day is filled with happiness that we achieved something, but sadness because their child will no longer need to be tucked into bed or read a good night story. But they have witnessed our victory too. We hit bottom as freshmen and lost so much, but we lifted ourselves up and began to run. We have accepted and beaten the challenge. Our parents and the amazing teachers and staff at Ukiah High School stood by us, coached us, and wiped our tears. We have learned how much we are loved, how much we can do and how strong we are. We have taken care of each other, and you guys, I am so proud of us. I asked my fellow graduates what they have learned in our four years here at Ukiah High School and how they plan on applying it. I want to share with you the insight of three seniors here today. The first is Cameron Parker, and here's what she had to say. As long as you exceed your own expectations, you are doing something right. That one person may not be able to make a world of a difference, but strength is an admirable and inspiring trait that encourages change. I also heard from Mariana Seja, and she says, Every person has different kinds of strengths. Our generation has shown that we can overcome every obstacle that life puts in front of us. It hasn't been easy, but it hasn't been impossible. And finally, Yaya Carlon, our senior class president, said, We need to inspire others to be strong and resilient in the face of adversity. When we demonstrate strength and courage, we become role models for others who may be struggling or facing difficult challenges. Virtually all of my classmates agree that Ukiah High School has taught them love, perseverance, and resilience, and that we are one stubborn but extremely passionate class. These are essential traits that we must carry forward into our lives to come. At this moment, I would like to say something to our parents and families. From the very beginning, we always looked up to you. You all made us believe that we could accomplish anything we put our minds to and that we could be whomever we wanted to be. You all have guided us through these past 18 years in our lives and we thank you for sticking by us through this incredibly challenging four years. You are all our biggest supporters and we have an unending amount of gratitude and appreciation for you all. We want you all to never forget that you have shaped us into the people that we are today. Thank you for everything you have sacrificed and struggled for in order to get us through school. To the teachers, staff, and admin at Ukiah High School. Some of us have grown to love you like our own parents. We thank you guys for always being a shoulder to cry on or just a place to vent. You all are a one of a kind faculty and we couldn't have accomplished the achievement in life without you. And finally, to my fellow graduates, as we walk across the stage today, looking back at our time together, we may wish we could go back to being little kids without a care in the world. But those kids that we used to be, we're looking forward to now. So excited for what awaits us. I hope you all hold the memories you made here close with you as you move forward, and I can't wait to see where we all end up. Whatever your next steps in life may be, remember what you are capable of and use that strength to benefit the future. So with that being said, congratulations to the class of 2023. Good job. Now, Ukiah High School, class of 2023, and parents, family, community, we are one song away from Why You Came, which is the awarding of the diplomas, but I need to hear some noise before I introduce the next band. Need some more noise. Class of 23, a little bit louder, please. 
the fans of the class of 23 a little bit more noise. The neighbors cannot hear you. More noise. The community needs to hear you. Please welcome to this graduation a band that has also entertained us for quite a time. Sí o no, sí, sí. Yes, yes, yes. Testing, testing. Nosotros somos los Wildcats del Norte. Espero que sea de su agrado esta canción que vamos a tocar. Ahí suena más o menos así, el muchacho alegre para ustedes. Dale ese compa Yair. que la vieron, a mí ya ni daño me hace, ya mis borros se murieron. Ahí va la loba del mal, me dicen los que la vieron, a mí ya ni daño me hace, ya mis borros se murieron. Te dije chata y te lo decía, si no fuera por la loba aquí los amanecía. Se me hace que sí que sí, se me hace que no que no, se me hace que tu marido no te quiere como yo.
Una vieja chismole al salir de su jaca Le dijo su compañera y va la loba del mal Una vieja mitotera al salir de la cocina Le dijo su compañero ahí va la loba del mal Te dije chata y te lo decía Si no fuera por la loba aquí los amanecía Se me hace que sí que sí, se me hace que no que no Se me hace que tu marido no te quiere como yo Guadalajara, Jalisco, San Juan de las Cuatro Esquinas Donde corre toda la loba por toditas las catrinas Guadalajara, Jalisco, San Juan de las Cuatro Esquinas Donde corre toda la loba por toditas las catrinas Te dije chata y te lo decía Si no fuera por la loba aquí los amanecía Se me hace que sí que sí, se me hace que no que no Se me hace que tu marido no te quiere como yo of 2023. Make some noise, Ukiah. And now please welcome to the stage Assistant Principals Cassandra Mortier and Yareli Macias, who will be presenting our graduates. Tylee Perez. <laughs> William Cassidy Bamber. <laughs> Logan Moore. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Brian Parmenter. Graduating with highest achievement, Julia Rose Salomon. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Jackson Longcrier. <laughs> Tisak Smith. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Jeremiah Raider Bailey. Graduating with highest achievement, Viviana Marie Reyes Aguilar. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Brian Boleto. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, 
Kylie Barrera. Graduating with highest achievement, Daniel Malarich. Graduating with high achievement, Diego Arreguin. Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Sage Fire. Elijah Alvarez. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Sebastian Palmerin. Petzabet Fuentes. Caleb Faber. Graduating with high achievement, Madeline Specials. Adamo B. Maldonado Linares. Graduating with high achievement, Kailea Nelson. Reina McLeod Benitez. Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Audrey Lancet Grilly. Melanie Alvarez Duque. Madison Brielle Bushby. JT Delgado Evangelista. Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Sinead Bermudez. Samantha Medrano Mendoza. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Grace Holly Huff. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Noah Edelman. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Sydney Marin Steinbuck. Blair Gant. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Haley Alana Newman. Sebastian Allen Rawl. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Lexi Marie Urbina. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Joey Reynolds Boatwright. <laughs> Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Audrey Elise Rhodes. Alondra Camposano Archundia. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Peyton Sarah Rogers. Dianesi Macias. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Ruby Mortier. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Kayla Tolman. <laughs> Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Helena Pearl Rooney. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Yajaira Carlon Maldonado. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Isabel Van Sant. Graduating with highest achievement, Leonel Pantaleon.
Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Diego Edward Fernandez. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Jesus Sanchez. <laughs> Bryce Feeney. Graduating with high achievement, Alexander Tambaguchi. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Taryn Iowa Upchurch. Graduating with high achievement, Roman Tampacucci. Maria Lupita Corona. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Dominique Ebert. Jacqueline Mesa Lopez. Caitlin Mitchell. Graduating with high achievement, Haley Gonzalez Sandoval. Graduating with highest achievement, Guadalupe Ayada Magdaleno. Graduating with high achievement, Amy Gomez Martinez. <laughs> Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Vanessa Cruz Peñalosa. <laughs> Nicolás Avalos. <laughs> Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Brisa Beatriz Fuentes. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Lily Sky Losak. Odalis Hernandez Ayala. Hannah Soderquist Roberts. Graduating with high achievement, Brian Anthony Hernandez. Dane Fazzoli. Aaron Garcia Velasco. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Isaac Atkins. Natalia Vasquez Velasco. Parker Wilson. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Victoria Vega. Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Francisco Muñiz. Graduating with highest achievement, Giovanna Cepeda Rodriguez. Owen Vandewerker. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Juanita Isabel Maldonado Sanchez. Graduating with highest achievement, Steven Torres. Graduating with highest achievement, Kaimani Capri. Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Luke Schott. Graduating with high achievement, Juan Magallon. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Hunter Snitches. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Kenji Jimenez. <laughs> Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Peyton Alexis Torres. 
Graduating with highest achievement, Bright Gibson. Graduating with highest achievement, Cecilia Solano. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Kira Fierro. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Sierra Rose Patterson. Veronica Perez. Graduating with highest achievement, Gianna Maria Lodigiani. Graduating with high achievement, Carmela Christine Carrera. Graduating with highest honors, Seal of Biliteracy and highest achievement, Sochi Vasquez. Graduating with highest honors, the Seal of Biliteracy and highest achievement, Katia Galvez. Jacob Larson. <laughs> Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Athena Maria Garcia Dahl. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Zachary Hunter. <laughs> Vincent Barrera. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Kiara Giselle Parr. <laughs> Estela Aime Delgado Mendoza. <laughs> Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Montserrat Curiel Lopez. <laughs> Layla Hoover. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Alex Castagna. <laughs> Madison Isaacs. <laughs> Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Kavya Rakesh Magan. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Nathan Looney. Graduating with high achievement, Kai Sebrian Ticker. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Alexis Alexander. Isaac Severe. B. Burris. Coda Dufour. <laughs> Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and high achievement, Vanessa Perez Rodriguez. Cameron Gernert. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Natalia Munoz Rodriguez. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Madison Miller. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Anthony Villalobos Espinosa. Graduating with highest achievement, Chesney Noel Kelly. Graduating with high achievement, Sofia Delgado. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Amanda Grace Mucho. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Madeline Armstrong. Maricela Salgado. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Nailene Anaí Álvarez Rodríguez. Graduating with high achievement, Devin Brown. 
Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Julian Alvarez Cardenas. Graduating with high achievement, Nathan Gibson. Graduating with high achievement, Lydia Summers Knight. Aiden Tears Jetton. Eric Ramirez Flores. Graduating with highest achievement, Elizabeth Andrade Gallegos. Donatan Agustin Bravo Sanchez. <laughs> Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Maribel Gonzalez Ceja. Mariana Chavez Gutierrez. Graduating with highest achievement, Trenton Taglio. Yeah. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Carla Alexa Garcia. Graduating with highest achievement, Trevor Frazier. Areli Hernandez. Graduating with highest achievement, Nicholas Weir. Reina Moon Pittman. Graduating with high achievement, Michaela Duran. Guadalupe Lopez Flores. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and high achievement, Noemi Mosqueda. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Yetzi Hernandez Barajas. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Suzette Escamilla. Graduating with high achievement, Eliana Garcia. Graduating with high achievement, Stephanie Hernandez. Noemi Castañeda Rodriguez. Daisy Garcia Diaz. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Giselle Carrillo Lopez. Graduating with highest achievement, Macy Brooke Johnson. Ariana Espino Ceja. Graduating with highest achievement, Autumn Lynn Walker. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy, and highest achievement, Isidro Valencia. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Jaden Elizabeth Diaz. <laughs> Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Brandon Beltran Ruelas. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Amelia Elizabeth Adams. <laughs> Daniel Valencia. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Callie Marie Garcia. Victor Leonardo Dominguez Velasco.
Graduating with highest achievement, Giselle Yareli Ortiz Avila. Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Andres Batin. Graduating with high achievement, Nancy Ramirez de Jesus. Graduating with highest achievement, Lidonee Salgado Solorio. Graduating with highest achievement, Giselle Regalado Lemus. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Arisbeth Budar Merino. Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Reese Bartlemé. Valeria Gonzalez. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Haley Espinosa. Graduating with highest achievement, Joanna Alvarez Oliveros. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Kimberly Randolph. Viridiana Oliveros. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Caitlin Studer. Graduating with highest achievement, Geraldine Renteria. Graduating with highest achievement, Sierra Alexandra Vasquez. <laughs> Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and high achievement, Alondra Montserrat Avila Ochoa. Cameron Grace Parker. Graduating with highest achievement, Ariana Nicole Adams. Gabriel Cruz Malfadon. Graduating with highest achievement, Isabella Boyce. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Adan Carrillo Arteaga. Graduating with high achievement, Elijah Christensen. Luke Incerti. Jordan Walker. Alyssa Holbert. Graduating with high achievement, Nathan Anthony Donatone. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Brayden Gomes. Graduating with high achievement, Alexa Vasquez. Jonathan Dubois. Graduating with high achievement, Lily Ann Andrade. Graduating with high achievement, Samson Clark. Graduating with high achievement, Alondra Garcia Garcia. Graduating with high achievement, Caitlin Baldwin. <laughs> Graduating with honors and high achievement, Aide Citlali Rodriguez Calvo. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Clayton Nidros. Vivian Elizabeth Maldonado Sanchez. Owen Brockett. 
Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Elizabeth Cruz Erostico. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Kamala Rose Williams. Graduating with honors and high achievement, Daniela Silva. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Mia Rain Gittleman. <laughs> Stephanie Seja. <laughs> Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Aria Whitaker. <laughs> Maritza Garcia Angulo. Ricardo Burrell. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Alexia Beltran Sasueta. <laughs> Gabe Allen. Julian Jose Castro. <laughs> Juliana Araiza. Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Marcus Capistrano. <laughs> Gloria Hernandez Silva. Graduating with highest honors and highest achievement, Owen San Giacomo. Isidra Gonzalez. Melissa Hernandez Velasquez. Isabel Noguerra. Azure Gomez. Graduating with highest achievement, Lillian Hardin. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Daniel Sandoval. <laughs> Milagros Guevara. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Johnny Jerome Silvera. Jaden Billy. Ryder Hedges. Graduating with highest achievement, Charlie Power. Graduating with highest achievement, Marcus Jacob Fink. <laughs> Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Fuller Parker. <laughs> Logan McLean. Graduating with high achievement, Lestat Cisneros. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Frank Garrett Nunnemaker. <laughs> Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Omar Balajo. <laughs> Braden Leslie. Graduating with high achievement, Oscar Dueñas. 
Graduating with high achievement, Xavier Isaac Chavez. Rance Redfern. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Gavin Judd. Jonathan Bird. Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Connor Judd. Matthew Vasquez. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy, Chloe Regan. Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Andrew Taren. Graduating with high achievement, George Duncan Hodgson. Graduating with high achievement, Aaron Kennedy. Graduating with highest achievement, Gerard Yusak. Graduating with highest achievement, Lillian Lutz. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Liana Lafore LaFrance. Graduating with high achievement, Waylon Clark. Graduating with high honors and highest achievement, Manav Mittel. Jack Henry King Ulrich. Graduating with high achievement, Michaela Aurelia McWilliams. Graduating with honors and high achievement, Darby Sutton Lee. Hudson Ford. Graduating with highest achievement, CJ Luke Rogowitz. Alejandro Guevara. Graduating with high achievement, Finn Meyer Kayser. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and high achievement, Adrian Cabral. <laughs> Graduating with highest achievement, Grayson Hargraves. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Lee Sang. <laughs> Graduating with high achievement, Riley Olson. Laura Samano. Graduating with high achievement, Mark Thomas Stratman. Yeah. Oh, and the seal of biliteracy. Enrique Nunez Cisneros. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Jesse Duncan Rickert. Christopher Ray Lopez. Graduating with high achievement, Alex Michael Marin. Angel Ortega. This is awesome. Graduating with high achievement, Thomas Anderson. Dulce Noeli Sanchez. Elena Marsh. Graciela Guadalupe. Camarillo Silva. Yeah. 
Henry Meyer. Francisco Peñalosa. Ryan Hardage Begeer. Alejandra Manjares Escobar. Diana Rodriguez Gonzalez. Carlos Soriano. Miguel Angel Diaz Mata Jr. Marisol Jacinto. Graduating with high achievement, Jesus Gallegos Martinez. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Emily Silva Hernandez. Graduating with high achievement, Moises Ivan Mendez Hernandez. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy, Yuleni Velasco Maya. Abel Francisco Ramirez. Rosy Hernandez Velasquez. Graduating with high achievement, Alejandro Muñiz Aro. Jonathan Isaac Ayala Leon. Katie Graham. Osvaldo Arroyo Torres. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Riley Alvarado. Santiago Moreno Peredia. Graduating with highest achievement, Pharaoh Lockwood. Daniel Cárdenas González. Graduating with high honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Jaden Borgna. Graduating with highest achievement, Daniel Rodriguez Nieves. Allison Reedy. Roberto Ceja. Graduating with high achievement, Aaron Gherkin. Angel Mesa Llamas. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Amir Barita. Graduating with high achievement, Oscar Rodriguez. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Berenice Gonzalez Lopez. Graduating with high achievement, Yair Martinez Galindo. Navia Shu. Graduating with high achievement, Oscar Nunez Ramirez. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and high achievement, Sophia Maurer. David Rodriguez. Lisette Chavez Rodriguez. Graduating with high achievement, Jonathan Diaz Lupian. Graduating with honors, the seal of biliteracy and high achievement, Mariana Ceja Gonzalez. Jonathan Ruiz Fuentes. 
graduating with high achievement, Caleb San Diego. Jocelyn Shudamaki. Graduating with high achievement, Jacqueline Rodriguez. Talias Sadlier. Joshua Petega. Makayla Raincourt. Graduating with high achievement, Marcus Wastick. Teo Robert Ramirez. Natalie Hayden. Christian Monroy. Kimberly Barajas Velasquez. Graduating with the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Marin Yvette Peterson. Graduating with highest achievement, Abigail Joy Dyer. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Griffin Gage Peterson. Graduating with highest honors, Liliana Marie Lucas. Graduating with highest honors, the seal of biliteracy and highest achievement, Sienna Maya DeFazio. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Kaylin Marie Hester. Graduating with highest achievement, Dante Brown. Joshua Tyrell. Fist bump, buddy. Vaughn Peña Jr. Maria Ballesteros Novoa. Julian Joseph Maldonado. Mariana Ballesteros Novoa. Victor Manuel Gonzalez. Adán Velasco Ventura. Anthony Garcia Olivos. Kaylee Sasueta Jaxiri Moreno. Joshua Alvarado Martinez. Graduating with highest achievement, Willow Morrison. Francisco Espinosa. Graduating with highest achievement, Casey Snodgrass. Jose Vicente Magaña. Graduating with high achievement, Cameron Snodgrass. Graduating with highest achievement, Cesar Eduardo Muñiz. Graduating with highest achievement, Joseph Parducci. Joseph Parducci. 
Jessica Alvarez. Graduating with honors and highest achievement, Liana Ramirez Nava. Luis Angel Fonseca. Raul Mendoza. Graduating with high achievement, Fabian Alvarez. Jaime Martinez. Graduating with high achievement, Andres Sanchez. Testing one. Yanni. Yanni. Well, 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 class of 23, let's hear it for these graduates of Ukiah High School. Class of 23, please stand and welcome your class president who will lead you in the crossing of the tassel. To the superintendent and to the board of Ukiah Unified School District, I present to you and certify that these students have met all of the requirements of the State of California Ukiah Unified School District. They are graduates of Ukiah High School. The crossing of the tassel will be led by the senior class president, and then we have a little surprise for you. One final performance, one final cheer, and you're all invited to be a part of it. Let's cross the tassels. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Everybody stay standing, hang on to your hats. We got one more to go. One more to go.
Gator Dad! You, you, you get it! I, 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 I! You get it! I, I, I! Go! You got it! USA! USA!